Well, millions are still hesitant to get the coronavirus vaccine, including some pregnant people. Top doctors are urging them to get the shot, though, before it's too late. It's a decision one local family now regrets as they grieve the loss of a young mother. Local 12's Marella Porter shares their story. This heartbreaking moment captured in time. A newborn baby lying on her dying mother's chest as her father lays his hand on her frail little body. It was kind of like bittersweet because we really wanted this baby, but now she's not here to say, share it with me. Jonathan Louvender still had forever to go with his wife, Brittany, and their two girls. The couple had just married last November and had finally gotten pregnant after trying six years for their second child. Brittany was only 27 weeks along when she tested positive for COVID. She was admitted to the hospital September 5th. The following day, she could no longer breathe on her own and was placed on a ventilator. 12 days later, Riley Rose was born, delivered by emergency C-section, three months premature. She's doing good, but mommy, mommy couldn't fight. Brittany died on Friday, less than a month after she was first admitted to the hospital. Riley Rose is their miracle baby. The day before her mother died, her father fought for Riley to have one last bonding moment with Brittany. It was amazing. Like all of her vitals went up. Like I have a feeling she knew she was there and she was just waiting to know her baby was okay. Luvender says if he'd known it would mean his wife's life, he wishes she would have gotten the vaccine. She wanted to wait till after the baby was born. It's a difficult decision thousands of pregnant women across the country face. Every pregnant woman wants to protect her unborn child. So hesitancy is very understandable. The CDC says 97% of pregnant people hospitalized with COVID-19 were unvaccinated, putting them at a 70% increased risk of death. Dr. Lisa Egbert says the risk from the vaccine is minimal and does not compare to the risk of COVID during pregnancy. I don't want to see this happening to anybody else, you know, because... I'm going through it and it's the hardest thing I've ever had to do. In Middletown, Morella Porter, Local 12 News. Your heart just goes out to that entire family. Now, Luvender says one of his wife's final wishes was for him to get the vaccine so that he could be there for their family. We can tell you he got his second dose just this past weekend. Their baby's going to be in the NICU until at least December. If you would like to help the family during this difficult time, we have a link to their GoFundMe over on Local12.com.